Session state allow you to store and retrieve values for a user in navigating as partner pages in a web application. This is page one username, so it will click on first session. It will go the username to the page two, the session state. Start Visual Studio, go to the Solution Explorer, add two pages to first session from one page to another. The first page name is page one. I'm just starting two pages. Click on add, okay. Page one is created. Now add another page, page two. Name page two. I will pass session from one page to another page one to page two. Uh, to pass session value, design this page one with two tax box. All. Add a level control and a tax box control. You can you uh, you can uh, use or add multiple session at a time. The text of this label is username and tax box name is tax box one. The page two. Just add a level control. The since the text of this label is the uh, it's blank, text is blank, and this level control is username. Here I'll show username uh, to ret from retrieving the page one, the session. Add button control. Change the text of this button. It's allowed to use a more than one session. I'm just uh, showing you a single session, one session below. Click to pass session as button text. Okay. To declaring session, first of all, write session user equal to text box one dot text what text you put in the text box one it will uh, go the session in the second page now response dot to redirect the simple difference between query string and session just see my first video is query string so if, I, uh, if you want to know about query string go to my first video you can see the video in the end screen or description box. Go to the page two. Just uh, level two dot text equal to. Just call this session. You can retrieve the session in any page of this project. String session. My session is user. See that user copy and paste I'm adding it in the load event so at the load the username will display in the web web page you can view in browser add username put username swift launch Username so if LAN is displayed in the page 2. Default session time is 20 minutes. You can increase or decrease session time. To change the session time, go to the solution explorer and open the web config file. In the system.web, you can add uh, you can increase or decrease session time after after passing the session time, session duration, the session will be null. You cannot have the uh, session value in the redirected phase. Just write session state timeout equal to. Uh, you can use the time minute, 160 minute or 100 minute. What you expecting? 100 minute. After 100 minute, uh, it will null the session 